Ground ball sent back up the middle. And there's out number two. The third baseman, number seven, Michael Franco. Ready once again, Michael Franco. He's got three hits, including a double to this point. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Pitch swung on and hit in the air toward the line in right. Reyes is there to make the catch, and that means we've got more. Phillies down in order. Score remains tied at four. Leading off for Detroit, the third baseman. First pitch of the at Gamer. bat on its way. Candelario. And here's a fastball called for strike one. Yeah. Late decision to swing that time, and as a result, it's 0 2. He had some really good late action on that slider right there. It's hard to do anything with that pitch unless you're sitting on it and catch it out front before it breaks all the way in. Pereira patrolling center makes the play one out. The catcher striding in and working on a terrific Grayson performance in this one. Grinder. Grayson Grenier and we'll see if he can put together a rare five hit performance here. Throw and he's called out on a close play at first. Now batting the center fielder next for the Tigers Jacoby, Jacoby Jones, Jones 0 for 3 with a couple of strikeouts for him to this point in the ball game ball one to start the at bat. Here's the 1 0. A ball and a strike. In there one and two now. One and two count here's the pitch. Popped him up. Kingery over to his right. And that retires the side. Down in order go the Tigers. This game's all tied at four. So striding in, Odubel Herrera. He lined out in his last trip, so looking for better fortunes here. Yeah, he hit it hard. That's all you can ask. You can't control the result sometimes, Matty. Just unlucky with the placement. Oh, one pitch on its way. Hit out towards second. And there's one away. Now batting. The second baseman, Dylan Cousins. At the plate, Dylan Cousins hit the ball pretty well in his last at bat, but it resulted in a line out. Yeah, Matty, it's always a little frustrating when you square one up. You hit a solid line drive like he did, and all you have to show for it is a jog back to the dugout. That can get in your head for a little while. The wind up and the 0 1. Hit hard to third. And a sliding try there at third, but it skips by him, a base hit. Next up will be the Phillies pitcher Vince Velasquez. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Here's the first pitch. Try to check it and it's 0 and 1. Well this has been a lot of pitches for him out of the bullpen as you can see there. They're asking a lot of him in this one so I wouldn't be surprised if he gets a day off or two after this one. Here's a late swing and a miss strike two. Possible winning run on first one man away. A one ball, one ball two strike count to the Phillies pitcher. Listen I'm not trying to make up an excuse but this is this guy's fifth inning of work in this game out of the bullpen. Are you kidding me. Nobody goes five innings anymore. Ready with another two strike offering swing and a miss on the changeup and there are two gone. Into the box, Andrew McCutcheon. He was retired via the ground ball last time up. Here's the first pitch. This pitch is popped up. Dixon is there to make the catch, and that means. Next up for Detroit, Josh Harrison. And he'll be trying to replicate that home run swing that he took back in inning number six. Laid off the bender there, but it's in for a called strike. 
A swing and a shot hit down the corner. Nearly a big fly to start the inning instead of foul ball. Now a pitch runs in on him here and all he can do is flare one foul off to the right side. The next 0 2. Gets him looking up around the letters. The batter, number seven. Shortstop. Now at the plate, Jordy, Jordy Mercer. It was Mercer. a flyout for him in his last trip. You're a Jared Eikhoff, a six foot now four inch right hander, comes in out of the bullpen to number do the 40. pitching. Jared. Eikhoff. One out, nobody on. Called strike 0 and 2. The 0 2 once more. Grounded to the right. Hoskins gathers it in. Oh, look at the sliding stop. What a play. The batter. The right fielder. Now to the plate, Dustin. the pitcher, Dustin Peterson, Peterson, 0 for 2 on the afternoon so far. Skied into straightaway right. Harper is there, and he'll make the catch to retire the side. Three up, three down for Detroit. Still all square at four for apiece. The Philly. The Ready now, down. Scott Kingery. Scott. Still looking for Kingery. his first hit here. He's 0 for 6. Now here's one hit in the air to the right side. And that'll get down for a base hit. Beggars can't be choosers right there. <laughs> we love those right long field. darts. That doesn't matter how they come. Right. Jam off the end of the bat right. doesn't right. matter. Here's the first pitch. Strike one to start the at bat. The 0 1. Now, this is hit not all that hard out to second. And indeed, he won't try to force it at second. He'll just flip on to first for the sure out. Now, batting. The first so a big moment in the Three. ball game here. Reese Hoskins. Hoskins. As he'll look to get the ball into the outfield and bring home what would be the winning Three. run from second base. 0 and 1 the count. The 0 1. Swing and a ball hit on the ground, but this will wind up a foul ball, strike two. Possible game winners at second base here with one away. Checked his swing there. Did he go around? No, says the first base umpire. Ball one. Now a ball hit hard toward first. A dive, but it's off his glove. Only play will be to the pitcher covering, and the runner will advance to third now. Ready for another chance? JT Real Muto. And he's got a chance to bring in the winning run. The question is whether they'll even pitch to him. Now a swing as he shoots this down the right field line. And a high bounce will take it over the outfield wall, and this ball game is over. Well, that at bat shows clearer than anything that some guys, they, they have that clutch gene, and some guys just don't. He brings home the winning run from second and is being absolutely mobbed by his teammates. What a finish. Every game has its offensive stars, and in this one, he arguably shined the brightest. He's our top player of the game. Yeah, not a big surprise here. I mean, he had more hits this one game than some guys get in a week, or maybe even a month. No doubt he gets the nod in this one. A one-run finish today, 5-4 to four, the final score. Philadelphia, 27 hits and people on Our base all game long. Afternoon. Jared Eichhoff takes home the win.